to today, I'm going to showcase the um my tweak of the week. And today we're going to talk about revolutionary multitasking on iOS. Many times multitasking seems efficient on uh, inefficient on every device, including iOS. Even though Apple has made a bulk load of new features about multitasking gestures and so much on iOS six and iOS five, there are better ways to do it. Now, when I when you are jailbroken, you must be jailbroken to do this. Let me just show you a quick demo of what I can do. Okay. Right now, I might my want to read the Bible. Um, here it is. Okay. While I'm doing that, I might want to draw. Okay. Okay. So. Now, oh, maybe I want to make this full screen. Uh, actually, I should rotate it so I can get the benefit of that. Oops. Um, I can get benefit of that right there. Hmm. I maybe I want to check up out my photos while I'm looking at all this. Really, guys, I know I might seem like I'm not doing handling it in the best way. I doubt anybody would do this, but they can do anything. It doesn't. It doesn't have to be what I'm doing right now. It could be anything. Oh, it's like chocolate. What is that? Hmm. Oh, I'm reading the Bible. Okay, I can rotate this. Rotate it. Okay, that works. Um, full maybe full screen. I guess yeah. I should pay attention to that. Okay, that's it for my demo. Now let me show you how to do it and get it for free. First of all, you want to head to Cydia. Let me just rotate it. Okay, now you want to head to Source Sources. And you want to go to Edit, Add, iHacks, Repo.com. Okay, so I'll just give you a second. Once you have added that source, I already have that source, as you can see. Now you want to go into that source, and you want to scroll down to to the Q section. You want to go into the Kasar, a multi-tap app window manager for iPad. Now you want to go into that. Now the same thing would be like for iPod or whatever, but mine is... Well, I'm using an iPad, so that's why it's displaying for me iPad. Now right here where I'm clicking right now, um, it will have install. I already have it installed, so that's why it's not going to be there. And basically, you saw basically showcase. I already showcased my the app and what's abilities to do the um hack or whatever you want to call it. And now when you go to you want to go to settings, and if you want to and check enable it or unenable it, you want to go to settings, and you want to scroll down to extensions and Kassar. You want to if you want to enable, it, you can obviously turn it off. You can touch background to quit, and you can play around with the options and stuff. You can click auto full screen app, so that means it will basically start up as a full screen open app, not as a half screen open app, as I showed you. Um, and that's basically it, guys. And remember, when you change anything, you want to click the ring now. That's basically it for this demo. Hope you like this tweak of the week. Like, subscribe, and check out some of my other videos. This is it for me of today's tweak of the week.